Hi, my lovely people. Section 107 Fair Use allows us to talk about it, and that's what we are here to do. Don't go out of your way to dislike anybody we talk about in these videos. It is for entertainment and reaction purposes only. Baby, let's talk about Olivia. Let's talk about her. We don't really talk about her over here, but everybody on the internet is acting as though they are shocked that she's treating the other children, you know, Gerard's children, differently. That she's saying Ryan is not the baby anymore, right? She's acting as though Ryan is annoying her. And she's sitting there coddling and holding on to that new baby girl that she had. Baby, did y'all expect anything other from Olivia? Now, I'm going to say the dirty old truth because that's all that can be said. We knew if Olivia, right, had a child that was a girl and that was fully biracial. And when I say fully biracial, I mean mostly the uh, W-H-I-T side had taken over that she was going to coddle she was going to love that she was going to be all into that little girl now let me tell y'all something about olivia she is a colorist and a narcissistic person we know this right in her mind not in my mind i am biracial i have a lot of things flowing through my brain so let me say that i don't see color don't care about color that's not my thing but from what we've seen with olivia it was right she had robin who was a fair but darker skinned child she was all into it and then all of a sudden when robin grew up she didn't know what to do with her hair she thought robin was going to have silky locks she started cutting off robin's hair she started perming robin's hair she started doing everything to make her be the girl that olivia wanted her to be olivia is obsessed with her own eyes her own skin tone her own hair that's why she can't keep her hands out of her hair she's always messing with it on camera she's cutting it off she's growing it out she's dying it she's shaving it she's obsessed with these things with these looks so when she had this baby who is now fair-skinned she is now like oh my god she's so happy she's hoping that this baby stays this color she's commenting on the color all the time and let me say this when it comes to babies baby one day they could be one color and the next day they could be the other color it can come in and it can go away that's just how it happens so you never know but it, that's why Olivia is doing this, right? That's why all of a sudden now, Ryan is not the baby. Get up. Stop acting like a baby. Oh, go do this. Go do that. She's not your baby, but you didn't treat her like that when you so-called had AJ. Now, did you? Now, did you? When you so-called had AJ, you weren't treating Ryan like that. That's why I still say it ain't her baby and it's Rock Kills. She wasn't treating uh-huh ryan like that ryan was still her baby remember she was on here i just need to go over there to gerard and get my baby ryan doesn't understand she's just a baby she doesn't know what's going on she needs her mother she's just a baby that's what she said right that's what she said and ryan still is a baby and for the age that ryan is she's been through a lot she's uh being torn between two households she's being torn between two parents she still wants the attention that a young child wants just like her other you know two children by gerard one but no this baby has come along she's obsessed with this baby she is so overwhelmed she is just like she is so joyful she cannot hold it does anybody wonder why she came out and showed that baby but she wouldn't show aj anybody wonder why anybody wonder why anybody wonder why she's got that baby in the screen uh, cold nick carrying it everywhere but she wasn't doing that with aj now was she she was going live and aj was supposedly in the other room with her mother every single time that uh we see aj stella is there when stella ain't there we don't see aj she wasn't doing none of this okay that's what makes everything super duper fishy with the whole aj situation who has custody of him who's his mama who's his daddy who knows baby this baby just popped up out of nowhere but with this one she was surely showing her belly she was showing her doctor's appointments she was doing everything when she found out it was a girl she knew who uh the dad was and she's like oh i'm getting a girl that i've always wanted remember she said that she said that when she was out here doing all of this, uh, bouncing back and forth and not knowing what's going on, she said, I'm going to get the girl of my dreams. Remember when she said that a couple of times on a lot of videos? And now she's got this little girl that she thinks she can mold and make her. And she's happy. She's going to treat the other ones different. She's a narcissist. She's a colorist. She's crazy. Y'all just thought, I'm, I'm just shocked that people thought that she was going to do any different. Somebody had to come out here and say the truth. It ain't because, okay, it's a 
brand new baby it's because number one she's obsessed with the color of that child and she's hoping okay you see her oh her hair's coming in look at her hair uh-huh uh-uh uh, uh yeah but as soon as it gets kinky as soon as it gets curly it's going to be choppy chop it goes it's not going to be cute anymore and i'm sorry i think that ryan and robin both have a beautiful set of hair and i think it just took for them to go over to their you know Tanisha's house and her to bring it out and take care of it. Olivia was not taking care of their hair whatsoever. And so, Olivia, what are you going to do when this baby grows up? If it turns out to be like your other children and it grows some color, then it's going to be, oh, well, I got to go have another one. She continued to have children until she thinks she got what she wanted. She is just over the top disgusting to me. And that's why I do not really talk about her. But I wanted to get out here and tell y'all the truth so that y'all knew it. Nobody is going to say it, but that's the truth. She thinks she has the baby of her dreams. Baby, I'll see y'all in the comments.